Hello, it's Jason Payne from Cold Banker Dan Hop Realtors. Today I'm out at the Fair Oaks Ranch area in the River Valley subdivision, located just south of Bernie, Texas, and an easy access to everything off I-10 to, to include like the Dominion and all that good shopping area. Anyways, this community is a Perry home community, and Perry has their biggest products in this community. And the house behind me is the 4891 plan. It is already bought and purchased by someone else, but they're getting ready to move into it. Perfect time for me to do a video for my out-of-state buyer who's considering getting the same plan built for herself. Anyways, let's go check it out. Apologize if the camera was a little shaky. It's quite windy today, but this is a really nice community. I wish I had started video and tours of this community before because it's such a little diamond in the rough, but they only have like nine uh, spec homes that have already been designed and planned out being built out here. Everything else has already been sold, including this beautiful home uh, built by Perry. And uh, to the person who's let me do this video, really appreciate it because this really gives my client and anybody else a good idea of what this plan looks like. Love the double doors. Let's head on inside. Right when you come in this home, you see the big, beautiful staircase, and you can't help but be awed by just how tall the ceilings are. Now, the owners of this house, they did a lot of, they got to go to the design center and do a lot of upgrades, including things like these wooden floors. But uh, I'll point out some of the upgrades, but right now, as I'm filming it, it is 6 April, 2022. And our market is such a frenzy that getting something built from dirt is really difficult to do nowadays. So across the board, almost all the builders are building spec homes meaning the sales reps or the design team has already picked out all the upgrades. So these guys got this house under contract over a year ago and got to pick out everything themselves. So this was the office, definitely loving the beams here. And of course I showed you the dining room right up front. Now the owners of this house have already started doing some of their own painting. So as we get through, we'll see some accent walls, but check out this main living space. Tons of room, big, beautiful island. I definitely love the color scheme and how tall this house is. Now, I mentioned this is the 4891 plan. That is also the square footage of this house. So this is a big, beautiful home. Love the backsplash that these guys chose. Now in this community, the electrics come standard. However, you can get a propane tank buried so you can use gas. It is already pre-plumbed for gas in both the cooktop and the fireplace. You gotta check out the sink. Beautiful single basin sink. And I definitely love the light fixtures that they chose. And they went with the double stack ovens and the microwave up top. Still not too high that you, it makes it too difficult. So I guess about the same height as your standard microwave. Plenty good size pantry. Oh, there's a little gift package that Perry gives them when they're closing. Very nice of them. Where your refrigerator is going to go or well, their refrigerator. You do have this really nice butler pantry in between the kitchen and the dining room. Definitely love the floor design that they picked out for the utility room. Got a little sink. A little wine chiller. And a little tucked away is a little powder room. And they opted for the frame mirrors, which look really nice. All right, this is a, does have a three car garage in it, tandem. And one of those things that I always recommend to buyers is if you plan to get your uh, garage sealed like this, 
do it before you move your stuff in because once that first thing comes in, it's done. You're never going to get that back to it. And you see it's plumb for water softener back there. But there are certain things you always want to do prior to moving stuff in. And that's kind of what these owners have done. You've got accent walls you need to paint do, do that. If you want to get the floor sealed, do that before you move in. And of course the garage. Gotta also point out, this is a Perry thing that they like to do. Oh, they've already started moving some stuff in. The extra storage. It does have two different staircases. This one goes directly up to the game room. And I'm gonna show you that a little bit later. But I do like this long-term guest bedroom tucked away in the corner downstairs because some of your long-term guests don't like going upstairs. Especially if it was like for say my mom that came to stay with me a couple days. She no longer does stairs. So putting her up in a room like this with its own full bath and shower would be absolutely perfect. They even got the little rain shower windows there. Rain glass. All right, well, since we're here, let me go and show you the back patio. And these guys who bought this house were probably one of the earliest ones to get into this community, and now this community is almost sold out. But because they were the early ones in the community, they got to choose the lot that they wanted. And this is pretty much an ideal lot, perfectly flat opens up to a green space, beautiful trees. I'm quite jealous of these guys, but they were brave enough to pull the trigger when this community was just getting started. But you'd have a really big patio area. The sun's gonna be setting on the front of the house, so happy hour time. It's gonna be perfect, and this lot is perfect for a pool. And they went with what I always recommend people. It doesn't cost too much to get an outlet on your exterior wall because putting an outdoor TV, even if you don't plan on it right now, down the road you just might. And they got additional plug outlets too. All right, I wanna save the master bedroom for last, so let's head on upstairs. But check out this fireplace. That is a pretty good upgrade, taking the rock all the way to the top because typically Perry only does the rock up to the banister. Ooh, that's a real wood burning fireplace. You don't see too many of those anymore. All right, let's head upstairs. All right, we're going upstairs. I love these stairs here. All right, let's go show you the two bedrooms that are on this wing of the upstairs house. Really good sized bedrooms with really nice closets. And this is gonna be a Jack and Jill, or kind of Jack and Jill bathroom because this room's gonna have its access to its own sink and vanity and then they will share the full tub once again they've upgraded to taking the tile all the way to the top standard only comes up like three quarters of the way and then we're coming into the other bathroom well the other bedroom here once again you can see the homeowners are already done a little accent piece so this room will never look like it again. So once again, thank you guys for letting me show off this beautiful plan built by Perry. All right, I love the little catwalk bridge coming over here and yet another bedroom. This is a five bedroom house. Before we get to the bedroom, check out this full bath. And once again, that is a beautiful tile. And uh, he took it all the way to the top as well. And here's that third bedroom up top. 
Blinds, people are kind of sometimes surprised, but most of the time blinds do not come standard. So they went with the upgraded blinds, upgraded to have the blinds put in. What a beautiful home. Check out the size of this closet. Yep, same size as the rest of them. Good size. All right, let me show you one of my favorite spots of this house. Right up here to show you the view from the top. All of these big windows. And that's gonna be this game room section. You can do anything you want to it. If you wanna make this like a kid zone, say put a couch here, kid TV on that wall, you can. Pool table, poker table, anything you want, you can do that. The owners, op they upgraded to having this little mini office put in. So uh, that doesn't come standard, but a really cool idea. And they've got this uh, closet set up back here for any type of game, storage, whatever you want. This is the stairs I showed you earlier from behind the kitchen. But check this room out. This is their movie theater. They just recently came in and did all the painting themselves to black it out. But this is gonna be an awesome movie theater setup. They had Perry Holmes put in the pass-through. They had it pre-wired for speakers. Builders don't like to provide speakers. That's always a owner's choice. So um, they will pre-wire for all the speakers. You just gotta come in and do it afterwards. But yeah, this paint, the owners have already done. They did that themselves. But so many activities you can do up here. This room is uh, going, this going to the attic or I like to call the Texas basement. Check out how much storage this has. It does have two water heaters up here. And just because the way the roof is set up, they're gonna have plenty of places to put like Christmas decorations and everything. So a really, added bonus all right let's head on back downstairs all right we are downstairs heading into the master bedroom and then we'll wrap up this tour i got the master bedroom tucked off around the corner beautiful like i said the owners have already painted this accent wall a nice uh charcoal gray which is beautiful L plenty of lighting and yeah they've got it already pre-wired so you're not going to see any speaker wires when they hang their flat screen tv but this is what i want to show you they did upgrade for the barn door option which is beautiful but check out this bathroom beautiful selections with the floor love that gloss finish love the color selection they did so you have dual, dual vanities, the makeup section, a beautiful freestanding tub. And check out this mud inset shower. They got to pick out the, ba the flooring, all the tile cabinets, like I said, in this market, it's, they're doing spec homes where the builders are picking out everything. Hopefully we get back to normal soon. But you do have a his and her closet. But yeah, right now our demand versus inventory, it, it's crazy. A little water closet and then the other closet. And there's where all of your brains of the house are going to go to for like your modem, your ethernet cables. All going to be coming into that one big box there. But absolutely beautifully done bathroom. And of course, eight foot doors. A beautiful entry. All right, let's wrap tour of the 4891 plan built by Perry Holmes. This one is in River Valley, absolutely gorgeous plan. If you're looking for a big five bedroom house, with lots of room for additional activities. It's a great plan and uh, 
If you want any more information about uh, the area, the community, the builders, feel free to reach out to me. I'm gonna leave a link to my calendaring app in the description box. And as always, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and keep sharing these videos with your friends and family. All right, take care now, bye.